ladies and gentlemen, and as always, thank you for watching. Uh, this morning we've been called by the Sheriff's Department. There is a vehicle in a flooded ditch off the side of the road. Uh, apparently the vehicle has water in it. Uh, do not know the extent of injuries. As always, we ask for prayers, good thoughts, well wishes for all involved. Uh, there we go. We'll see what happens. Uh, hopefully I don't start out my morning getting soaked. But uh, Anyway, that's part of the job. Here we go. told me it should just be right over this uh, bridge. You say it did have water in it? It started leaking in the oh, yeah, passenger. The, yeah, I see it over there now. Yeah. Yep. All right. Well, let me get tied onto a wheel and get it drug up out of here first.
Hi, Shauna. Uh, if you want to go sit up in the truck, you're more than welcome to. I was like, I was just going to ride in with my mom. Oh, okay. Yeah. He, he has to worry about the car, too. I said, once you have to stand out here in the rain. Pull forward just a little bit.
mosquitoes everywhere. Midwest truck. Right. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah. Yes. All right, thank you. All right, bye. Do you need anything out of here? All right, I'm gonna pull forward and swing the back end around. Darn thing keeps locking and unlocking itself. down this road yep you'll see a car wash and a vfw oh yeah bingo the, hall the, right okay. after that there's a little auto body shop it's right there on the left right before the fire station or is that different yep. one? it's right before the, right fire, before station. the fire station okay yep. all right gotcha all right all right well as you see no injuries Just somebody's vehicle, which they can be replaced or repaired. We'll go up here and see what they want to do. As always, thank you for watching and God bless. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and as always, thank you for watching. Today, water recovery number two. We had some uh, 
heavy, heavy flooding rains last night, and uh, now we have another vehicle that's either hydroplaned or lost control somehow, overturned and out in a cornfield. That is all we know other than the location. Do not know what the extent of injuries are or anything. As always, we ask for good thoughts, prayers, good well wishes for all involved. Uh, here we go.
Oh, wow. Good morning again. We're going to do this all day? Uh, probably. There it is. I saw part of it. <laughs> yeah. What is it, even? It's a car. Okay. Uh, I'll take your word for it. Yeah, it's a car. What's left of it? I didn't know if it was too muddy to get out or what. What y'all want to do? That's why I brought that bigger truck. Yeah, it's 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 in there. Probably to save the corn, we'll just go pretty much the same route it went in, Brad. Yeah, we can yeah. probably get on. Uh, I can be able to walk the cable out along this side here. Yeah, they hydroplane. Pretty much same deal as earlier. Yep. Yeah, except this is worse. Yeah. Just there. are they okay? Oh yeah. Dude, there was two kids in there. They didn't have a single scratch. You're kidding me. No. My goodness. From here, I can't even tell what it is. Yeah. The uh, the inside is pretty much, like, good. It's just the outside. Wow. I don't know what kind of car that is, but that'd be the one to get your kids. No kidding. <laughs> From what I can tell. But, yeah, I'm, I've just been hanging out with the trooper here. He's he's your guy. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, I'm going to take a picture of this. Yeah. That looks pretty rough. They just barely missed that utility box, too. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Which trooper am I working with? McKnight. Okay. If you want to holler at him, I'm going to tell him I'm probably about to get on that. Here. Yes, sir. Let's see. I got traffic control and that other rollback that you saw earlier. Oh, okay. Yeah, I brought that truck because being in a cornfield flooded, I didn't know if we would need bigger winches and stuff. Morning, sir. What do you think? I think we'll take it out the same way it came in. Right, better off. That way we, we don't damage it. That way we don't damage the corn any more than it already is. Yeah. I don't think we're gonna hurt the car any. Nah, it nope. All right, I'll pull up, pull up here, and we'll just bring it out this way. Chances are it'll roll back on its wheels when we're pulling. So, you need me to hang out at night? I'm good. I got it. All right, brother. All right. Right, you I'll need anything you. special from me? No. Okay. Oh, we can get it out of there. Oh yeah, we can. We can get it. Ain't no. Ain't no problem. <clears throat> Just toss it in the car, Brad. Or in a pile right there. In a pile. We didn't see it until we got right up on it. Looks like it's gonna have to come out this way. Yep, that's what we're doing. As soon as he moves, we're gonna move up here. How deep is that right there? I don't know. Have to ask Brad. He went through. Well, we'll just have Brad run the line. It's okay. It's all good. Do what? Hyundai. Good little car then. This one looks like an SUV. Good toss there, Brad. Good toss, Brad! <laughs> Ethan, 
Let's close the scene up a little bit. Bring that up and I need my gloves. Yeah, no kidding. Fire department may have done that to get them out. Oh. May have. Just give me the uh, ones off the dash. I had them drying, they were wet earlier. They're already wet, so might as well use them. <laughs> that thing just wants to go for a swim. He needs help hooking up. Just, you need a chain, just grab something low on that front side. I think if we grab something low, it'll go ahead and flip. Coming over. Well, that thing keeps wanting to go fly or go swimming. It was funny, yeah. It was like it just walked right back into water. All right, go ahead and get her hooked. Up. It's all right. Let's get her hooked up and get her out of here first. leave it down in the cradle for right now and that way all the side pull is down in here against these Teflon pads. Do you have enough or do you know? While it, well, let me bring it on up a little bit more. Once we get clear of that uh, corn row, I'll have you hook it up to the top and hopefully it'll bring it right back over. And then we'll get a V bridle on it. I'll show you. Whoa. All right, gonna have to run the second line so that it. No, it's gonna hold, okay. Now redirect and go up to the top and it should flip, come down on, it, on its wheels. Good news, our pond's almost full. Yeah, I saw that. I didn't, I guess, realize we got this 
Oh yeah, there was a lot of rain last night. I mean, I heard it was supposed to, but I didn't think it'd be anything of this caliber. They kind of come out of nowhere. I slept Whatever you can get to that's easy to undo, Brad. You're not gonna damage the car anymore. Leave your loop long enough that you can get to it. Leave your loop long. Loop long. There you go. That's not an SUV. Yeah. Or maybe it was. But uh, one of them is like a green single or a tandem axle, and the other is a uh, white tandem with a drop. Okay. No sleepers. This is going to be fun. Let's go for a little drink. Get a drink. Thirsty car. Yeah, that's why I didn't want to walk through there. A lot deeper than the Maybe I'll find it together. Huh? I'm just gonna suspend it like that and pull forward a little bit. Huh? <laughs> you need anything out of it? Gotcha. Side curtains for sure. Steering wheel, nope. Steering wheel bag didn't. Seat side did on this one. I don't know. Side curtain there. Probably doesn't get it. I can't see from up here. It goes all the way back. This one oh. Huh. It goes all the way back to here. One solid curtain. Yeah. Well, it did its job. Yep. Maybe she's in there. And yeah, I was going to say, watch out for the snakes and. Yeah. Don't need anything else? All right. I'm gonna pull forward just a little bit, get it dressed way up on the road. I'll unhook and he'll come in with the roll back and load it and we'll be out of here.
what? I'll put that up for me, please. Yeah, I know. All right, I'll move, you come on up. Or turn around and grab it from the back, whichever. Does not matter to me. I did my part, now it's your turn. get on the other side of him I'd if I could get on the other side of him I'd block traffic going that way but Still just rushing through there. You got everything loaded in. Thank you, sir. Woo. Can you jump in and cool off? It's all yours. There's the remote. Do what? Yeah, you need to be need to straighten them if possible. You want to help him, Brett? Please. Can I cut these? Uh, for right now, I wouldn't, just in case. A little bit more. There you go. You're straight. Tough little vehicle. I mean, the rain didn't hold up. Occupants were uninjured, though. 
And he said there was two kids in it. Whoa, dude, slow down, slow down. Not you, him. Okay, you're blocking the roadway, so go ahead and get one line on it and get over, back over here to the uh, yeah. parking lot. We'll finish tying it down over there. He's just gonna throw one quick tie on it and then we'll go over here to the parking lot and finish so we can clear. No Thanks, sir. Thanks. Appreciate it. Everybody clear? Yep. All right, yeah, just bring her over in the parking lot here. Thanks, sir. Now the water's just still rushing through there. And Trooper said nobody was injured, including the kids in the vehicle. That's amazing. Whew. Well, we're going to finish up, head back to the shop and see what's next. I got a feeling the day's not over. As always, thank you for watching. God bless.